Welcome to today's video. Today I have a short and sweet loft try on video for you. I asked you guys last week on Instagram what some of your favorite types of videos were and I was actually pretty surprised that a lot of you like fashion try on videos. And I know I've done some of that in the past but I really want to start doing them more regularly at least once a month if not twice a month. So I took my camera into the loft store the other day and I did a little quick try on. I actually ended up getting some of these pieces so I'm just going to kind of walk you through the outfits that I purchased and the outfits that I tried on and kind of let you know how they fit. Before we get started, to give you a little bit of reference, I'm five foot two inches and I weigh about 118 pounds, 117 to 119 pounds. Um, I am usually an extra small in the top and usually a small in the bottom. I range between a two and a four in bottoms or a 26, uh, sometimes a 27 in jeans if they fit really, really tight. Um, however, I find it interesting that certain retailer sizings are always different. Uh, I find the loft to run a little bit bigger and I'm going to show you some pieces that I ended up having to size down quite a bit. So without further ado, let's get started. So this first outfit, I actually end up purchasing both pieces. I end up purchasing these jeans and I also purchased this top. These jeans are the curvy skinny jeans and these jeans run very, very large. The jeans that you're seeing here in this frame are a size 26, which is usually the smaller of the two sizes I range between, a 26 and a 27, but they were really, really large. I ended up purchasing a 25, which I will show you here in just a second how the 25s fit, but these jeans felt so comfortable and great on the body. They have have quite a bit of stretch. They are a thicker jean, so I don't really know if I'll wear these a whole lot as we get into the really hot months in summer because I can I can sense that they'll be pretty hot. Um, but I did like the length of the, these jeans. They're perfect for my five foot two inch body. I can wear them completely rolled down or I can cuff them and wear them up, rolled up once a bit if I'd like. This shirt is so lightweight. I actually bought it in the uh, navy and white stripe that you're seeing here. And then I also bought it in an ivory color. It's so lightweight. I like it front tucked in there. You can see that it's a little bit longer in the back. So it covers the butt a little bit. Um, it has a sweet little ruffle sleeveless. Um, kind of detail on the sleeves. It has buttons down the center at the neckline. It's just a really cute top. I think it's great for work if you work in an office. I don't. I work from home, but I think it's a great top to wear out to dinner with girlfriends or a date night. Just kind of casual, but just a little bit elevated. I really, really like um, this whole outfit. I wanted to show you how thick these jeans were. I mean, I'm sorry, how much of a stretch these jeans had. If you can tell by the waist, they have quite a bit of stretch, but they are perfect. My body is definitely more curvy. You can see that I've got um, a little bit more back there <laughs> than I do in other parts of my body. So it's nice when I find a pair of jeans that um, fit me well. So this next top, I actually ended up per passing on this top and I kind of regret it because it was such a great basic tee. It has some fun texture to it. I don't know if you can tell, but it has this interesting texture. And then it has like this little twist knot um, in the front. It's just a really easy to wear tee. It's great with these jeans. I actually did not purchase these jeans. I found them to fit a little too loose, but I did like the frayed hemline at the end, um, at the bottom of them. But I like this shirt because you can wear it with jeans. You can also wear it with leggings, which I pretty much live in leggings, I would say at least half the week I'm wearing Lululemon leggings and I think this top would look really cute with that. These jeans were 27 and I wanted to show you how big they were. If you could see me stretch, they had a lot of room. Um, I thought they were cute jeans, but I ended up passing. I could have obviously gone down a size, but I have a few pairs of jeans from the loft that are this light wash color. So I just felt like I didn't need another pair, but um, they do have a little bit of distressing on the pocket there, but they're really cute, really comfortable jeans. If you are in need of a light wash pair of denim, I do think these were really cute and they had an nice fit and they were the perfect length for shorties and these were not petites. So I wanted to show you what this top looked like paired with shorts. These are just like denim drawstring shorts. I didn't get these. I kind of wish I had though. I have a pair like this from Target that are pretty much identical to these. So I didn't purchase these, um, but they're really comfortable. I think everyone should own a pair of denim shorts in their wardrobe just like this. Um, they're just comfortable. They're easy to wear. They're great for summertime. You can wear them with flip flops. They're obviously a really casual short. They're not really something that you can dress up a whole lot, but if you live pretty much in a casual attire, um, I do think you'll get your fair share of wear from those shorts. 
and just ignore my black sports bra here. I did get this really cute scallop tank. Isn't it so cute? I love the neckline. I love a really pretty V neckline and I love the scallop detail around it. Um, it also comes in black, which I am going to order that as well. I did purchase these shorts because I think it's just the perfect outfit. Um, you can see that it has a scallop detail at the bottom of the shorts. These shorts run pretty big. So I purchased a size two and I have worn these twice already and they, they, they kind of, I don't want to say they stretch out, but they do, get a little bigger throughout the day. So I, I kind of wish I had tried on a zero just to see how they fit, but they're really cute. They're um, obviously kind of dressier shorts. You can dress them up or dress them down depending on how you want to wear them. I just wanted to show you what this top looks like if you untuck it. Obviously, I think it's much cuter tucked in, but I wanted to show you the length of the top. Okay, I loved this romper. Um, this is an extra small. I actually ordered it in a small. I think the extra small looks like it fits me really well and it looks like it could work, but it was just a little too short for my comfort when I sat down. When I sat down, I felt like it hiked up and just showed more leg than I like to show. So I ordered this in a small, but I absolutely love this romper. I think it's so cute. It has a little ruffle at the bottom of the shorts and just a really cute little drawstring tie around the waist. Oh, I just loved it. I love the colors. I love the print. I think it's so cute and feminine. I also think you can wear this romper with like flat sandals. If you have the Tory Burch Miller sandals, which I have in black, I think that would be an easy way to wear this romper. I also think you can wear this with heels if you wanted to dress it up and wear it with like a nude strappy sandal with a bit of a heel. I think that would be really cute. I think I love rompers and I love jumpsuits because they're such easy outfits. You know, it's, it's so stylish, but it's so easy. You don't really have to think about your outfit. You grab one piece and you're put together. All right, you guys, and that's it, short and sweet. I only had time to try on a few pieces, but I do feel like everything I tried on are really great staples for your wardrobe. The Loft is always having sales. In fact, when I was in that day, it was 40% off pretty much everything. I feel like they run that 40% off, 50% off sale all the time. So I will have everything linked down below. Definitely check it out because chances are it is either on sale now or it will be on sale like tomorrow. So I'll have everything linked down below. Leave me all your questions and comments in the uh, comment section below. Let me know what other stores you would like to see try-ons. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.